Hello guys, how are you doing? So, welcome back to my reactions, and as you can see I'm going to watch episode 15 of Sword Art Online Alicization War of Underworld today. So in this last episode we got to see a really sad moment, which was uh, Berkeley dying, but uh, at the same time the fight was so amazing to watch and I really loved uh, the, the animation they used, it was really different from what I'm used to in this anime, but yeah, it was really impressive and I think they did a phenomenal job with it. And right now I'm really curious to see what's going to happen because uh, Bercoli, while he died, he was still able to do a lot for Elise and he was a really great guy, definitely one of my favorites from uh, this season. And um, right now Elise is uh, safe, but uh, we know that... Um, uh, Miller is not done yet, so he just learned that um, some of the Japanese players are now coming to this uh, underworld uh, with their accounts from the other games, so he decided to do it as well, and the other guy as well, so we are going to see their own characters in the underworld, uh, most likely, so it's uh, probably going to, uh, to be uh, even more dangerous. But I'm still really curious to see what exactly they're going to do and hopefully Asuna and the others, like everyone who is fighting right now uh, to save Elise, uh, will be able to, to get to her as soon as possible and then proceed from, uh, from there. Uh, but yeah, really can't wait to see what's going to happen in this next episode. So with this, really hope you guys are ready and let's start it. Is my favorite. I'm also rewatching second season now because it's all connected. Just to be more clear about some of the things. And Yeah, a bit too late now. Hmm. And just go with another account. Yeah, he's dead in the game, but not in real life, so... Bog them some time, but... Still did a lot. Time is precious in this situation. Yep. Yeah. 
Exactly. Understand her though. Hmm. So we, we will spawn there? It's so painful for Elise. She really can't let their sacrifices be in vain. She needs to keep moving. I also wonder about that situation with them uh, trying to save Kirito. The other guy in the real world had a plan. But I'm suspicious of the guy who offered his help. I don't know. It was interesting to see the, the logic behind what they were planning on doing, like using the... Kirito's self-image that's like uh, inside of um, his friend's floodlight or something and use those to like rebuild his own self-image or something like some really complicated stuff but really interesting to see it at this point it's kind of clear that He's going to need his friends to return to normal. Damn. Oh, this guy. Nice. Damn. Is there arms and everything? Damn. They faced before, right? Hmm. 
So is the curse broken or like... Oh, damn. It's really emotional. Yeah, that was quite something. I know they faced before and there was... She was already wondering about this. But now the curse is really gone and... She understood. Or like realized what she was looking for. <laughs> well, It's worth trying, I guess. But I think if all of his friends stood in front of him, maybe that would create a big impact. Let's see about that. Oh, oh it's the other guy, right? With his own account. It's not Miller though, it's the other one. Can't remember his name right now. His one. Oh yeah, this guy. I'm currently rewatching all of the seasons, so now I remember these guys way better. Damn. More coming. Yep. Yeah, now that they say it, the language didn't seem from American, so I was wondering. That explains. Damn. I don't remember seeing that animation. 
So it's a bit different. Hmm. That's what they're going with. So they all target the Japanese ones. These guys have no idea. Hmm. Hashtag save the underworld. His manipulation. I feel like these guys are actually going to help. That was really fast. Oh damn, he's coming. Yeah, and Sinon is going to have a nightmare now. This is really personal to her. Damn. It's going to be a problem, that's for sure. Let's see how these guys do, though. Yeah, this guy though of course Is that a gun or something it's not good The other guy though. The other guy. Let's see what they do. Is going to lead them, of course.
Hmm. Yeah, this really sucks. I don't know the story, so... Oh, damn. She can't use her powers too often. Damn. I'm worried about Sinon, though. There's a lot of these guys, but they're not that strong, it's just more numbers. It's going to take a long time to get rid of them. Hmm. Yeah, this guy. These guys are always involved. Laughing coffin members. I need to be careful with that guy. I knew it. I was already really suspicious of him. The way he offered the help and stuff. How he was acting. Damn, that's... it's like nothing goes well for them. Recoli managed to, to buy some time for Elise, and now she's on her way. But Sinon is going to have to face Miller. And now, there's a lot of these Korean and Chinese players coming, thinking that... The Japanese are hacking into the server and attacking the testers, which is not true, of course, but they don't know about that. Now, our friends are going to have a lot more trouble. And it's not like the fights are against these players. Probably not going to be that hard, except for... P.O.H. Mostly because they have the default equipment, so... It's just big, just that uh, they have a lot of members. So it's going to take a long time to deal with all of them. I'm worried about Sinon. That guy is... Not someone you want to mess with. Hmm. I'm really curious to watch uh, this next episode. I mean, I'm curious to watch everything because this story is uh, really good. While like it, it, it's still a bit complicated to pick up on everything, but that's the reason why I'm currently rewatching everything. I just finished the first season of Sword Art Online. I'm currently at the middle of uh, the second one. Uh, so yeah, I think um, there's like uh, some people that I couldn't remember before because I watched the second season. Uh, like s quite some time ago, uh, but right now I recognize 
a lot more people. I believe that um, one of the guys who, who, who showed up, he looks like a, a cowboy or something. Uh, he was throwing these arrows in this episode, right? Um, almost at the end. And he was the guy that Kirito defeated first, right? With uh, the lightsaber. So yeah, that was really interesting and I'm probably going to recognize a lot more faces right now. Uh, but yeah, it was definitely good to watch uh, this episode, but a lot of bad things are currently happening and it's definitely not going to be easy for our friends to uh, deal with, with all of this. And mostly with uh, Miller and POH, like they're going to be really hard to deal with. And uh, I still need to be more sure about this whole situation and uh, again that's the reason why I'm rewatching everything as soon as I uh, catch up to like the point where I'm at right now like with the uh, elicization I'm probably going to understand things a lot better and right now I just really want to understand each episode as best as possible and then when I'm um, up to date with uh, everything like when I rewatch the, the other things uh, uh, previously uh, I'm probably going to like get all of the, the details and stuff. So yeah, I'm not too worried about not understanding some of the things right now. Uh, but yeah, it's uh, I'm still really curious to to see uh, what exactly is going to happen. I was already really suspicious of that guy uh, who just offered some help uh, uh, for the other who was uh, trying to to help Kirito, and right now it was proven. So it's a uh, like nothing is going well for these guys. Like there's always something that happens to to mess with uh, with them again like they were already defeating the american players and now they need to deal with this korean and chinese players so it's uh, like it they just uh, keep coming and it's really delaying them so yeah in the end this is uh, not that good uh, but at least Elise is on her way so she she won't have to deal with miller for a while i'm not too sure uh, of like what's going to happen with Sinon because that's definitely going to be really hard for her and really hope that um, she doesn't get killed of course uh, but uh, even if that happens or like depending on uh, how it happens of course at least like she wouldn't die in real life but uh, it would still be bad because uh, that would mean that uh, Miller uh, could go after Alice again uh, so yeah, really hope that doesn't happen and I'm really curious to see what will happen as well when Alice uh, finally reaches this altar. Uh, but that's something that we are probably going to, uh, like, it's probably going to take a while for that uh, to be shown. Uh, but yeah, right now just really enjoying every single episode. It's really fun to, to watch all of these characters. It's like, this is uh, one of the first anime I ever watched. So it's um, like special to me and I really love everything about it. And right now, just really can't wait to, to watch more of these episodes. Going to have to wait uh, for the next week to watch another one. So with this, really hope you guys enjoyed my reaction to this one. And if you did, please like and subscribe to the channel. And you can also join my Discord and my Patreon if you want to get early access to my full reactions. So yeah, I'll see you all next week for the next episode. So take care, guys.